Hi guys, thanks for clicking on to this video today. I'm just gonna do a little recap of 2020. I'm gonna start from January and then update you guys till now. Moving on to March. Hi everyone. Okay, so March was a real rough one for me, which I'm sure was a real rough, real rough one for everyone but for me specifically every time i like think about it it makes me more upset i already told you that me and the guy weird stuff was it was just weird like a weird place for us so march i was going home for my little brother's birthday my little brother turned five this year i had made plans for the weekend so the plans were to go home for my little brother's birthday come back and um spend some time with the boys right well right before i left to go home I get a call from a friend and she's like, Destiny, come up here. Your boy's up here with my roommate. She just checked him in, blah, blah, blah. So I think they're playing a joke on me because I'm kind of, I like easily believe stuff. I'm thinking they're joking on me, but like joking with me, but they knew that I was about to leave because like I had just got a phone call like, come downstairs, you're about to leave. I like took the stairs. I didn't even take the elevator. I took the stairs because her room is right next to the staircase. So as soon as I got off the staircase, I had my bags and everything because like I was literally about to go. So I knock on the door and the roommate answers. I don't like conversation at all, but like I'm worked up at this point because you're acting like nothing's wrong. We made plans to hang out this sun like the Sunday, and you're in here with another girl acting like nothing's like a problem. She answers the door. I'm like, I didn't speak to him. He takes a while to come out. I was like, are you messing with her? You messing with her. It took forever for him to say, We talking. And I'm just like, in my mind, if I'm talking to you, you're not talking to anyone else. And that was not the case with him. So, I had to go to my little brother's birthday that same weekend. Had to put on a face. I was livid. And usually, you know, people go through stages when, like, I don't know if it's heartbreak, but, like, I felt some type of way. Like, I was like, I felt some type of way. The, I think the first stage is, like, like block block don't talk to me i'm over you this that whatever say so you have this wall built up so it's just like hmm i wasn't sad i was like frustrated mad because like there's nothing i could do about it it's just it was just a mess told my mom and my mom got mad she started like trying to search everybody up on the football roster and then um i just had an attitude the whole week i was playing music um jenny aiko i don't know if i say her name right i don't think so back up on my bull that was my song back up on my bush back up on the scene done dealing with you don't know how to deal with me done with you and then olivia o'brien her whole was it even real it just explained everything that i felt and i was just jamming to that jamming to that and then i went through the stage of why me? Am I not good enough? I'm not pretty enough. And that girl that I caught him with, she is bad. Like, she looks good. And I just feel like, well, at least he, like, kind of made an upgrade, but not really. So, yeah. When I got back from my brother's birthday, we had basketball games. And he went to the basketball games. But whenever we saw each other in person, he would not say anything. Like because he knew he was wrong. And he knows I don't like confrontation. So I'm not, like, I, I had to say what I had to say that day. And then that was it. I'm not going to sit here and argue, especially over a boy. So that was that. Oh, and then quarantine happened. So we had to go home in March. We had to leave campus. And that gave me time to reflect. And I feel like it was honestly good for me because I didn't have like the opportunity to go back and like yell at him or anything. Little recap of that. I found the guy that I was talking to with my friend's roommate in the room, in person. Went through that little like angry, like frustrated phase. Had to go to my little brother's birthday party like that. Upset, frustrated, heartbroken, I don't know. And then we had to go home for quarantine, so that gave me time to reflect. I wanted to like better myself, everything. But yeah, that was March. It's a pretty rough one for everyone, but that's how rough it was for me. Moving on to April. Thanks for watching this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!